firearms are definitely an expensive hobby where quality usually matters and quality usually means spending a good amount of money. Take a look at, for example, optics or the quality of the firearms themselves. That does not mean, however, that you need to spend a ton of money to get some good basic tools. And one of the best values that I've seen so far, particularly when it comes to tools, is going to be this punch set well, Hammer and Punch Set by Toughman Tools. So this is going to be a great starter set for pretty much anything that you'd want to do as a beginner gunsmith or whether you're working on your firearms or even things around the house. So what you're going to get here is you're going to get the hammer, which is going to have both a nylon end and it's going to have a brass end. Uh, you definitely don't want to use a steel one for most things because you don't need anything that heavy and using something like steel will damage the finish on both, well, your punches and if you're uh, hammering the firearm itself, it's definitely gonna leave a mark. Um, so on top here, you do have two roll pin punches. You have a 1 16th and a 3 30 seconds, which is going to be enough. Um, generally, these are gonna be the two that you would need if you're putting together your own AR-15 lower. Um, do note that if you're putting something together, you definitely do want roll pin punches because they have a little ball in the middle of it, which is going to go right into around the roll pin if you're to support it. If you're using a standard punch, so I'll use this as a good example. Um, if you're going to use this as a standard punch with a roll pin, what's going to end up happening is you're going to end up deforming the roll pin and you don't want to do that. Uh, so besides the two roll pin punches, you have two standard 1 16s and 3 30 second punches. So this would be, let's say for example, if you're using for other pins, so let's say for example trigger pins or other pins on other firearms where you do not, uh, where you're not pushing out roll pins. Uh, you do have two polymer um, punches, which is actually something that's new. I haven't generally used these, uh, but if it's, let's say, for example, if you're trying to knock something out that's going to be aluminum or something a little bit lighter, or it's not in there with a pressure fit, then these are gonna be perfect for it. And then uh, the center piece of this is you have three, six, eight, you have an eight piece brass punch set. And this is gonna be perfect for pretty much any other job that you'd wanna do. Uh, let's say, for example, you're installing sights on a firearm. Uh, that's what you would use. You wouldn't use steel. Because steel against steel, it would mark up the finish. Uh, you definitely don't want to use roll pin punches on that. And polymer might not be strong enough. So you'd use your brass punches. And you can use brass punches pretty much on anything aluminum uh, or steel. And uh, because brass is going to be softer, you're not going to mar up the finish or you're not going to damage those parts. Um, overall, for the money, this is going to be a great set to get you started. You don't need to spend a lot. And let's say going to a Home Depot or Lowe's and picking the stuff up individually, you'd easily be spending hundreds of dollars. And these kits are nowhere close to that. Uh, overall, nice, just, nice job, Toughman Tools. Uh, love the set, using it more and more.